Hello and welcome to IndianMoney.com's YouTube channel. My name is Fayaz. Sovereign Gold Bond's latest issue is out now and if you're a person who always wanted to invest in gold but are a little scared about investing in physical gold and always were aware about the fact that uh, buying a jewelry is not a wise option then this particular video is respectively and dedicatedly for you because this video will talk in detail about uh, not just the issue of Sovereign Gold Bond that's happening right now but we'll also talk about uh, in detail what are the pros and cons of investing in a Sovereign Gold Bond. So without a further ado, let's get to the point. The number one detail over here that I want to share with you is that the issue date of this particular option is from 11th of January 2021 to 15th of January 2021 which means you have still another two more days to invest in this particular option. Now talking about uh, the price a per gram of gold here will cost you 5054 rupees and if you apply for this gold via the online platforms then you will be able to get a 50 rupees discount for this entire process which means uh, your one gram of gold will now cost you 5004 rupees only and uh, it's available in dematerialized and uh, electronic format so you don't have to worry about the physical position of the gold and the interest rate which you are getting over here is 2.50 percent per annum which means you will be getting uh, this interest rate twice a year which is 1.25 percent and 1.25 percent respectively now let's get to the advantages and disadvantages about investing in this particular option the number one advantage that you get over here is that you are investing in gold but you're also making interest income out of it unlike the the idea of buying physical gold where you're just getting the position of the jewelry that you buy or even uh, when it comes to buying a gold coin or a gold biscuit you're just having that particular gold at your respective house lockers or your bank lockers but you're not able to make any regular income out of it but here you're getting an advantage of not just investing in gold having gold in your portfolio but you're also making interest income out of it no matter how small it is or no, how normal it is compared to any other kind of investment option that are available in the country but you're at least making some money out of it in that case it is a better investment option the another advantage that you get over here is that it is available in paper and dematerialized format which means you don't have to worry about the physical possession of the gold and uh, if you're a bachelor if you're a person who stays with a couple of roommates in that case also you will be able to invest in this particular option because you don't have to worry about the uh, the storage of this particular gold the next advantage over here which you will be getting is that you get tax benefits as well there is no tedious uh, that will be applicable on your interest income and also there is no capital gain tax that you will be getting on the the amount of money that you'll get after the maturity of this particular option however the interest that you're making out of uh, the investment option is uh, taxable under your respective tax labs so you're getting two benefits over here number one is that you're not getting any kind of tedious and also the capital gain tax is also not applicable when you invest in a sovereign gold bond and last but definitely not the least the most amazing advantage is that this is a government backed scheme which means that you can be secure about the fact that whatever you're investing over here is 100% safe and it's in safe hands and also after maturity you'll be able to claim your money back which means you will not be conned in the near future as well so in that case you will be happy satisfied and be will be in a much more peaceful state since this is this entire investment option is backed by the government of India. Now talking about the disadvantages or the cons of investing in a sovereign gold bonds, the major disadvantage over here is that the duration is very long. Some people might find the duration very, very long, especially if you're an impatient person, if you're a person who looks for short-term investment option. Uh, the duration for this entire process or the maturity period of this entire investment option is eight years. And if you're a person who might, uh, you know, look out for it, liquidating your investment option as early as possible, then you will be able to do it only after the completion of fifth year of your investment. So in that scenario, this is uh, one of the major disadvantages of this investment option. However, if you look at it from the other perspective, you are investing in a long term thing. So it's better in terms of getting regular income and your amount of money that you're investing also is with the government of India, which means your amount of money is also safe. So the next disadvantage and the last disadvantage that you will be getting over here is that you might end up incurring a capital losses. Now, what do I mean by that? Uh, for example, today you're buying one gram of gold, which is costing you 5,054 rupees. But tomorrow, suppose the gold prices drop after say eight years, then you might not be able to make most out of it because the gold prices might be fluctuating and you might also end up incurring losses. However, the chances of it are very, very less because government takes care of the price volatility and also about the market fluctuations. And also, if you look at the gold prices right from the independence of our country, gold prices have always been going upwards. Uh, when uh, in the year 1964, basically gold was costing uh, 10 grams of gold was costing around 64 rupees, and today it's costing close to 50 to 50 thousand, uh, 52 thousand rupees uh, per 10 grams. So looking at this particular perspective, you will be you can be sure about the fact that the investment made over here in sovereign gold bond will be much more better compared to any other kind of investment, especially if you are a person who wants to invest in physical form of gold. This is a much more 
investment option that you can opt for. So let us know your thoughts in the comment section and also uh, let us know your feedbacks as well and help us improve. And if you haven't downloaded the Financial Freedom app, please do download it. The link of this app is provided in the description box. And if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon as well so that you never miss an update from IndianMoney.com's YouTube channel. My name is Fayaz and you're watching IndianMoney.com.